I literally thought I was recording the cold start on this thing and uh, yeah, totally missed it. But anyways, um, first gen started up. We're gonna record a little video for you guys here going over this truck and everything that we finally got done to it. And one last look around it here. Here we go. We're gonna be doing a ride along in the first gen and on top of a ride along in this first gen, I'm going to be going over some of the things that we've done to this truck and some of the things that uh, you'd like to know in terms of the background details that I have on it at least. And then we're also going to go into a couple of details on things that we now have on the website as well. So that way you guys can be informed of all of the amazing stuff going on. Let's get to it. On top of that, you're gonna to get to enjoy going through some gears with me in this truck because I figured I haven't done a video like this in a long time where it's kind of like a ride along. I'm talking to you about stuff, but in the same sense, we can do it while we're driving the truck. So, enjoy. For those of you that do not know, the giveaway is live right now. You can actually enter to win this thing at lnpgear.com. That's our website, links in the description below. The giveaway is only five weeks long, start to finish. So, you know, not a ton of time to enter, just a little bit over 30 days. And it's gonna make somebody a really, really, really sick truck. So uh, I definitely suggest you get in on it while you can, because also right now is our highest bonus of the entire giveaway, which is every $1, 30 entries. So if you haven't done that yet, Links in the description, lmpgear.com. Buy anything on the site and you're automatically entered to win. Another update on the site, we now sell three different options of the VIP program and they're all the same in terms of, you can get free shipping for all orders over $20. You can get 30 times entries for everything you order on our site or if you just want the subscription, every month that it renews, you're gonna get 30 times entries for the subscription that renews as well. But in addition to that, for the entry level, 10% off everything on the site. Premium is 20% off everything on the site. And the elite membership is 40% off everything on the site. But it only works as long as you stay subscribed to the membership. That's how it works. And I really recommend those for people that either A, they just don't want any physical products, or B, uh, they already buy a lot of stuff from us as it is. And so they could actually get some pretty good benefits and perks to signing up or something like that. Another update, we have mystery cash bundles on the website, which means you can buy a bundle from our mystery cash collection, and every bundle comes with mystery cash in it. And mystery cash can be anywhere from $10, $20, $50, $100, $500,000. Um, they're, they're, they're pretty legit. And there, there's no $1 bills or $5 bills that you're gonna find in our bundles. The minimum you're gonna get is 10 bucks. And that's like the minimum. So uh, if you wanna be a guaranteed winner, 100% chance of winning something, any bundle that you buy from the Mystery Cash Collection is going to get you Mystery Cash in the bundle. Anywhere from $10 to $1,000. And even if you win, thousand dollars once twice it doesn't matter how many times you would win that much money uh, you're still entered for the truck and the five grand that comes with that as well so you're not like disqualified if you you know get cash in your orders from buying anything in that collection okay all orders get you qualified but if you like additional adrenaline rush because you like winning like time after time the mystery cash bundles are a great way to make sure that you get a guaranteed win as soon as you check out on the site you're at least going to win something so definitely take that into consideration there's also other stuff. We have, you know, some new jerky. Oh yeah, the jerky is back in stock and it's literally disappearing as fast as we get it on the site, it disappears. So check the video. Hopefully there's still some more in stock by the time you see this. Uh, it is a super sought after product and it's our number one seller now since we started selling jerky. It's just been absolutely flying. It's, it's not loaded up with all the crap that jerky normally is, like all the gas station garbage that you go buy, like with tons of different preservatives and, and MSGs and stuff. Our stuff is very, very, very premium. And it's not stuff that's literally like designed to kill you, okay? It's jerky that literally has that incredible taste and texture that you love when you, what you expect from a high quality jerky uh, without all the toxic stuff that quite frankly doesn't need to be in it. It is restocked currently, but I'm sure it won't last long because people love it.
what else here? Okay, so let's go over the things on the truck that we changed. So, quick little background on this truck though first. I actually found the truck local. It was actually for sale pretty close to me. And the guy that bought it, bought it from a local dealer. And what's interesting is the local dealer that he bought this truck from, which is Weekly's in Ohio, the guy that he bought this truck from is the guy that my grandfather bought tons of his used Dodge pickup trucks and cars from for decades. Uh, my grandfather pa passed away a couple of years ago now. He always used to buy his used trucks and some of their used cars, not all of them, but from this dealership, and it's called Weekly's Dodge. It's in Butler, Ohio. And uh, they apparently bought this truck, is, is what he told me, they bought this truck because they had a place down in Texas, they found the truck down in Texas, they bought it, and they were gonna you know, give it to their son or grandson, something like that. And uh, apparently he you know, just said that, yeah, you know, I'd rather have like an actual car, not a truck. You know, I don't really care for the manual, I don't really need a diesel, like, uh, yeah, it's cool, but it's not for me. Um, which I'm sure, like, if it was if it was my son or my grandson, I'd be heartbroken because there's nothing cooler than a five-speed four-wheel drive first-gen Dodge from Texas that has freaking zero rust on it. Uh, they don't vehicles don't get much better than that, in my opinion. Uh, now everybody has their own opinion, and in all honesty, I don't blame the kid. Uh, if I didn't have any options and I'm not paying for it, I wouldn't say really anything at all because, well, I'm not paying for it. I don't get to be too choosy. However, in the same sense, the kid's got a point. If he's never going to tow anything, he doesn't need a diesel, he doesn't need a manual, he doesn't need heavy suspension, it's really not the best vehicle to just be running around the snow, you know, in the Midwest here because, well, quite frankly, the snow and salt combination on the roads, mostly that being the salt, it destroys vehicles. They do not last long here. And this truck was pristine condition, original body panels, no rot, no rust. And so I'm, 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 actually, I'm actually very glad that... Uh, the kid was able to persuade his relatives to getting him something uh, a little bit different so that I could buy this truck off of the guy that bought it. Let's get on the road here. Okay, so when that guy bought it, he painted the truck gunmetal gray metallic. And that's actually the color of the dually that we had painted back in uh, July is when we had it painted. The giveaway started the very last day of July going into August. And then that giveaway was a fan favorite. Uh, people loved the truck. They loved the dually. It was a five-speed. It was a four-wheel drive. It was a first-gen. People loved it. I don't blame them. It was one of my favorite old-school trucks we've done, hands down, especially from 12 valves. Um, that thing was awesome. And that brings me to my number one reason as to why I like I liked this truck right away as soon as I saw it and I wanted to jump on it. And then I found out that it was a five speed and it was four wheel drive. It, it just, I couldn't pass it up. I said, everybody loved the dually that we did that was the same color and it was the same transmission, you know, five speed, all that stuff. Let's do it again. That's the perfect candidate of a truck, you know, and it's not a dually, but everything else about it is the same got 170,000 miles on it and those are the actual miles on the truck and so you know there's going to be guys that don't know what they're talking about that go 170,000 miles oh my gosh that's crazy that's such high mileage guys almost any 10 year old pickup truck that's rolling around on the roads got 170,000 miles on it unless they hardly ever drive you know my dad's got a truck that's 10 years old and he's got 160,000 on it and he doesn't drive near as much as some people so you know it's a 30-year-old pickup, 170 actual miles, that's pretty darn good. And especially since these are hard to find with any mileage that are in this good a condition, I think I did a pretty good job finding this thing. And they're not always close by and easy to find. This one happened to pop up right at a convenient time and it was close by. But most of the time, you got to drive a long ways to buy these things. And they're usually not in this good a, not in this good a shape where somebody else has already poured a bunch of money into it. So, all that being said, we got a great platform, an amazing truck. Moving on to the next part, we put brand new Toyo MTs on it, 285, 75 R16s, 16x10 16 pacers were already on the truck, but we took some uh, wheel cleaner. We actually sell wheel cleaner on our site. We took some wheel cleaner and you know polished the wheels up as good as we could to get some of the brake dust and crap off them just to make it look a little bit better, a little more presentable for the truck. And then we put new LED smoked 
housing lighting on the front end of the truck, new smoked LED, switchback and sequential um, daytime turning signal lights up front, as well as some smoked out turn signal slash marker lights on the fenders of the truck as well. And it just brought the whole look of this truck together so nicely. It looks, it looks phenomenal and I couldn't be happier with how it turned out. It's not always easy um, putting a truck together because you know sometimes there's not really anything that we like done to them and sometimes they're very tastefully put together and we only put our spin on a few small things and in this case luckily we were able to only change a few small things and really get this truck looking just the way we wanted downshift going up this hill but anyways so that's a little inside scoop on the truck. Beautiful truck, runs great, shifts through the gears flawlessly. Couldn't be any happier with it. And if you want to get entered to win this thing, super simple. LMPGear.com, links in the description. Just tap that link, buy anything on the site, you're automatically entered to win. And just remember guys, you cannot win if you don't enter. So if you do not enter, you guarantee yourself of not winning. If you enter, you at least put those odds in your favor and this truck could be yours. So definitely take that into consideration. Let's get a little segment just going through the gears. Get a little downshift coming around the corner. And this truck does have an aftermarket clutch in it. It's definitely heavier than stock, I'll tell you that. Usually the stock clutches in these things, especially the worn ones, I mean your pedal just like falls to the floorboard. This one, you got to put a you got to put a little bit of foot behind it, um, but it feels good. It feels good. Get a little downshift. We are back at the house and so I'm going to wrap up this video here but hopefully you guys enjoyed the video let me know if you like this style of video just like a little ride along while going over some things on the truck just inserting some video clips to kind of make it flow a little bit and uh, hopefully you guys like it because if you do I could definitely start to do these a little bit more uh, the YouTube thing like I enjoy doing it but we've got so many other moving parts with life and our business and stuff now that it just takes a whole lot more of my time away from being able to do the YouTube videos as much. Uh, but definitely check out that stuff on the site like I was telling you about. You're definitely not going to want to miss it. There's some really good stuff on there that I think you'll really, really like. And just keep in mind this, okay? This truck plus five grand could be yours, but you never know if you don't enter. Best of luck.